what the actual f is going on with Shiba Inu. I have no idea, but I do know who has an idea. I know who bought before this rally and it's not a nobody. Here's the news, the masses get fed. They simply just follow crypto Twitter. They try to find out where the alpha is. This is not where you're getting it. Instead, it's way better to follow the important people like Rune Christensen, who totally got this rally. Rune Christensen, founder of MakerDAO, he swapped 100,000 USDC, interestingly enough, not die, for 7.4 billion tokens. That was at four zeros and 13. Now the price is at four zeros and 20. So he conveniently bought over here just before the pump. He knows something we don't. And I believe that's the key to crypto success. The key to making money in crypto is to be better informed than others, to know what the insiders know, to follow the insiders. You can try drawing random lines on charts and then argument your way around this. Say, oh, we've been at a support and yes, now Shiba relative to Ethereum might be expensive and maybe we turn around again. And you might even work with on-chain analytics and see how retail is selling while the whales are buying and thus conclude that maybe it makes sense to buy. This tool, by the way, is also part of premium. Besides the alert that we've just seen, right, we're tracking all kinds of influencers. We've also got on-chain tools and we can see things like this. This is all nice and rosy, right? This is the number of wallets that hold $1,000 worth of the ship token. A small retail here on the left, medium-sized retail, that's $10,000. And the whales, that's over here on the right, $100,000 worth of the token. Rune Christensen joined that club just recently. That kind of data is useful, but especially for short-term trading of altcoins, it's always best to look at what are the best people doing. It's much easier to copy the winners than trying to become the best informed in the market. That's a nice thing about the blockchain, right? It's all transparent. We can all track this. It's not like in traditional finance with stocks or it's not like with centralized exchanges. On the blockchain itself, we can see what the real heavyweights are doing, what the smart money is doing. We don't have to be smart ourselves. We can simply just copy the smart people. So here's the other news. Rune Christensen hasn't yet sold. So potentially this rally can last for a bit longer. Once he does trigger the sell button, I will make another video and publish this on YouTube. Of course, if you want to know about this earliest, then feel free to join premium. Link is down below, thebitcoinstrade.com. Feel free to subscribe. I publish videos regularly. A like would be very much appreciated as well. It helps the channel grow.